PhD students to become familiar with the following common statistical tests in SPSS. ANOVA. Analysis of variance tests are used to compare means between two or more groups. One-way ANOVA is used for one independent variable, while factorial ANOVA can be used for two or more independent variables. ANOVA, or analysis of variance, is a statistical test used to compare means between two or more groups. One-way ANOVA is used when there is only one independent variable, such as the effect of different teaching methods on student achievement. Factorial ANOVA, on the other hand, can be used when there are two or more independent variables, such as the effect of teaching methods and gender on student achievement. ANOVA tests are based on the assumption that the data is normally distributed and that the variances of the groups being compared are equal. The results of ANOVA tests are typically reported as F-ratios, which represent the ratio of between group variability to within group variability. A significant F-ratio indicates that at least one of the groups is different from the others, but it does not identify which groups is different. Post hoc tests, such as Tukey's HSD or Bonferroni, can be conducted to determine which groups is different. ANOVA, or analysis of variance, is a statistical test that is used to compare means between two or more groups. One-way ANOVA is used when there is only one independent variable, while factorial ANOVA can be used when there are two or more independent variables. The test determines whether there is a significant difference between the means of the groups being compared or if the differences are due to chance. The results of the ANOVA test are reported as an F-value and a P-value. If the P-value is less than the chosen level of significance, usually 0.05, then there is evidence of a significant difference between the groups. If the p-value is greater than the chosen level of significance, then there is no evidence of a significant difference between the groups. ANOVA is commonly used in many fields, including psychology, education, and business, to compare the means of different groups and determine if there are significant differences between them. Regression analysis. This test is used to examine the relationship between one dependent variable and one or more independent variables. Regression analysis is a statistical tool that is commonly used in quantitative research to determine the relationship between two or more variables. The dependent variable is the outcome of interest, while the independent variables are the factors that are believed to influence the dependent variable. Regression analysis helps researchers to understand the strength and direction of the relationship between these variables. It also enables researchers to predict the value of the dependent variable based on the values of the independent variables. There are different types of regression analysis, including simple linear regression, multiple linear regression, and logistic regression, among others. Regression analysis is a powerful tool that can help researchers make predictions, identify patterns, and test theories in their research. Chi-square test Used to examine the relationship between two categorical variables, the chi-square test can be used for both independent samples, when the groups are different, and dependent samples, when the groups are matched. The chi-square test is a statistical test used to determine whether there is a significant association between two categorical variables. It involves comparing observed frequencies to expected frequencies, based on the assumption of independence between the two variables. The test is commonly used in social sciences and health research to determine whether there is a relationship between variables such as gender and smoking status or education level and health outcomes. The chi-square test is useful for identifying patterns in large data sets and can be used to make predictions about future events. It is an important tool for researchers and analysts who need to examine the relationship between categorical variables in their data. Factor analysis. This test is used to identify underlying factors that contribute to the variation in a set of variables. Factor analysis is a statistical method used to identify underlying factors that contribute to the variation in a set of variables. It is often used in social and behavioral sciences to identify and explain complex relationships among variables. In a factor analysis, variables are grouped based on their correlation with one another, and then these groups are interpreted as factors. These factors can then be used to summarize and explain the relationships between variables in a more parsimonious way. Factor analysis can be exploratory, where the underlying factors are not predetermined, or confirmatory, where the underlying factors are predetermined based on theory or previous research. Correlation analysis. 
This test is used to examine the strength and direction of the relationship between two continuous variables. Correlation analysis is a statistical method used to measure the strength and direction of the relationship between two continuous variables. Correlation coefficients, such as Pearson's R, are used to quantify this relationship, with values ranging from minus 1, perfect negative correlation, to 1, perfect positive correlation. A value of 0 indicates no correlation between the two variables. Correlation analysis can help researchers identify patterns and associations in their data, which can inform further analysis and research questions. It is important to note that correlation does not imply causation, and further analysis may be needed to determine the nature of the relationship between the variables. It's important for PhD students to choose the appropriate test based on their research questions and data type. It's also crucial to correctly interpret and report the results of the statistical tests. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe. Happy study.